Welcome back, you bloody legends. It's Aussie Gamer 17, and this is my achievement guide for the. Oh, what's the name of the achievement? It's on the uh, front of the video. It's called Double Zap, and it's for beating Aztec on Secret Agent difficulty in nine minutes or left, uh, or less. Sorry. Now the um, the time is really not important here, guys. You'll you'll beat the level in under that time limit. Um, it's just about surviving, getting to the end, getting everything done and making it through, which has been the case for a few of the levels, guys. So without waiting any further, let's get into the level. Uh, and again, it is uh, Gamer Aussie uh, doing all the running and gunning, and you've got post-production Aussie here doing some commentary after the fact. So yeah, make sure we go into Secret Agent. Okay, guys, the first thing you want to do here is sort of um, just creep out a little bit, even um, duck down like I am, and get this guy without the guys over on our left seeing us. That is going to make them um, come over here. You want to take as little damage as possible, less than I took just there. Um, once again, if I wasn't recording, I'd probably just restart uh, restart the level there for, from taking that much damage. I'm going to start on the left-hand side when you open up this uh, part of the wall and take out as many guys as you can from right here. Hopefully some more will come running, there we go. And you take them out. Usually back up a bit so that you can grab cover if you need to, I'm being a bit risky here now. You wanna get the guy behind this box, so just creeping along here until you can just see his arm or his shoulder. Go on the left, tried to throw a grenade at me, the dumbass. And the same thing here, use this pillar as cover to take care of him. And that should be everyone in this room. And now you want to make sure you grab everyone's ammo as well. We're going to need all the ammo. I never make use of the grenades because it's such a random pickup. That's a, another point, guys. I don't make use of grenades that we pick up because I don't know if everyone following along is going to be able to pick up a grenade as well. This here, I just want to shoot this guy's arm basically to lure a few of the guys out and use this as a choke point and take, take them all out here as they come through. We're using the assault rifle as well. And we've got good cover if we need it there. So once again, make sure you grab all their ammo. This here opens the door if it's not already open. It was just closing. But yeah, if you need to, you press the button there. And now we're gonna get the pistol back out. We're gonna headshot this guy without him noticing us. Usually one headshot would do. Oh, Gamer Oz, what are you doing, mate? And we're going to head up here and we're going to take a headshot on this guy as well. Usually without him seeing us. And then you want to do a headshot on these next two guys as well. Jeez, oh, Gamer Oz was in a real hurry. Um, once again though, you don't need to be in such a hurry. So normally you do two headshots or three headshots on all those guys and it's quite simple. And then you'll lure some guys out from this room by using this gun. Um, now if they don't come running out, what you do is shoot this computer here from outside the room, and then they'll come running um, so you can take them out. I was shooting the left, and I'm shooting here again now just to lure some guys from our left, um, trying to get them to come up to this spot here. And as soon as I kill this guy, I normally want to grab... Oh no, that's when I'm playing on double O Agent. Uh, if I was playing on double O Agent, I want to grab that laser um, gun just to conserve ammo. But um, yeah, you want to lure these guys over to this spot as much as possible. And once you've got taken care of them, creep around the corner, take out each turret. There's one on each side. And make sure you head right, after checking the left, of course, like I did there. And once the coast is clear, head right and grab the body armor. Oops, be careful. Yeah, I've been doing some practice runs for my 00 agent run of this level as well. That video will be next, guys. Uh, once you get to this crate here, don't run out like I nearly did. You want to take out the turret that's right in front of us there. You want to take out, there will be one or two enemies through that other vent over there. You want to take out both of them if there's two. Uh, you want to take out both of these turrets while still inside this vent. And then you want to duck behind this box that I'm using for cover here. And you very rarely get shot like I did there. And you can also shoot the last turret from behind this box without it being able to get you. Now we're gonna creep around the left of the box and you'll be able to take out these guys without them usually being able to shoot you. So one guy there and then one guy here. And then there's the last guy at the back right. 
uh, I'm going to leave him and go up the ladder first, am I? I normally go and take out that guy first, but it's probably quicker this way. So probably the right thing to do if you're doing, trying to do a speed achievement. So go up the ladder. You need to close these doors. The reason you're doing that, I don't think I pointed out. No, you've got to close those doors though um, so that you can get back um, to the earlier part of the level. I'll show you in a moment what we do, but make sure you run back here and take out this guy. Do not shoot that mainframe computer thingamajiggy like I nearly did. Do not shoot it. All right, now we head out here. Make sure you pick up any ammo that we picked up along the way. And once you get through this little gap in the wall here, you want to take out one or two guys and then Jaws is going to come after us. Once Jaws comes after you, you can either um, stay and fight him, definitely get out the assault rifle. I'll show you an even easier method. So he's ran off the other way. I'll show you an even easier method on the 00 agent run, um, which I'm sort of doing right now. You want to run back to here and lure him up here so you're just taking just Jaws on usually. Yeah, yeah so I do show it in this run as well. Um, if you can shoot better than me, you'll uh, he'd be dead by now. Uh, just sit here, you've got some good cover. Another guy tried to come and get involved. And again, I'm shooting everything except for Jaws. Do doing well. But shoot Jaws and grab his key card. That's what we need. As soon as you've got his key card, you can run off. Back through the vents, guys. Back the way we came. So we're going to head right here. Back through the vent out through the other door. This door would be shut if we didn't um, use that computer up that ladder. And then you can interact with this computer to open up here. Check your right. Sometimes some guys come from your right. Open the glass door. Pick up. So I'm doing it wrong here, but you've got to pick up. So go into your inventory. Go to guidance data. Pick up the little um, thing on the right hand table and then operate the machinery on the left hand table. And now we're heading back again. You will get some guys that have spawned in or that have come after you. Um, back through the vents once again. Sometimes you'll get some enemies once we get out of the vent in, in this room. So you need to take care of them. Just depends on where they've spawned and whether they've got you. So these guys here are all, not always going to be here, but they might be in different spots. Once you've done taking care of the room, make sure it's clear so you're not getting shot at while you interact with this. Get out your launch protocol, what you call it. Hit the button at that mainframe, and then you need to run back up the ladder. You can ignore enemies basically from here on, really, unless they come up the ladder, which I don't think I've ever seen them do. So don't worry that you're being shot at if you're being shot at there. Hit the computer to open up the doors again, the blast doors or whatever they're called. And as soon as those are open, the shuttle can take off and that'll be the end of the level. Hopefully this is helpful, guys. If it is, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and post a comment. Both those things are a cheap, a free way to support the channel and help the channel. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Guys, if you want to join me, uh, join the Aussie Army over on Patreon for just $1, head over to there. There's a link in the video description. Or hit the join button here on YouTube and become an Aussie Army member. Get your name on the credits scene at the end of my next series, guys. All right, guys, and that's it. We did it in 7 minutes and 21 seconds, which was actually my best time on this file, so that's cool. Got the cheat unlocked. Got the achievement. Oh, there it is. Yeah, good hearing that sound on the channel again, guys. Really appreciate all the support. Like I said, please hit the thumbs up, post a comment, all that good stuff. There's the bell. You know what that means. Class dismissed.